What's going on everybody? This is Captain Obvious, or Cap for short, and welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. Okay, so I'm back with another little mini uh, totem statue thingy here. And this one you can stick on top of the last ones that we did. Um, I happen to really like this one. I think this one's my favorite so far out of all of them. Um, but yeah, it'll, I'll show you what it looks like together with the previous um, statue. You can also look uh, at the end of the video. I will leave a link and in the description for the previous, previous version of this build. Okay, so let's just get into what you need and how to build it. Here's everything you're going to need. Either pause it or take a screenshot. Uh, you're going to need some end stone, some end stone bricks, some end stone brick walls, some end stone brick slabs, end stone brick stairs, honeycomb blocks, acacia buttons, acacia wooden slabs, acacia trap doors. Going to need some purple blocks, some purple stairs. Crying obsidian works really, really well. You can also just use like purple blocks if you want, like per, like uh, concrete. Uh, we need some purple slabs, pillar purples or purple pillars, crimson trap doors. We're going to need some prismarine brick stairs, dark prismarine, prismarine bricks, magma blocks, dark prismarine slabs, warp trap doors, and three stacks of dirt. Okay, so as always, what we're going to do, we're going to build four back and then four across, and then we're going to fill it all the way in. Okay, and we're going to go up with it 12 times. So this is one and then go up 11 more. Okay, now that that's done, what we're going to do is we're going to start on the bottom left hand side. We're going to take our prismarine brick stairs. We're going to go regular stairs there, regular stairs there. We're going to break these eight blocks in the middle, put prismarine stairs there. It's actually four up. So one, two, three, four. Okay, put the prismarine stairs upside down there, break these. We're going to put a our dark prismarine right there like so, okay? We're going to take our prismarine blocks, put them right there and there, so they're recessed back. And we're gonna take our magma blocks and we're gonna put those in the middle. Now we're gonna take our dark prismarine slabs and we're gonna go across it just like so. And then we're gonna take our warp trap doors and we're gonna go around all of the front and sides Okay, oops, <laughs> front and sides, and then do the exact same thing that we did here on the back. Let's swing around to the side, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna put prismarine brick stairs there, upside down there. We're gonna put prismarine blocks there. We're gonna put them there as well. Okay, so it's gonna look just like that. Now we're going to take our prismarine slabs, put them there and there. Again, so they look just like that. And now we're gonna take uh, just some junk blocks really quick. So we're going to put some dirt oops, just like that. Okay. And then we're going to put them here and here. Swing around here and here. You can break the junk blocks. So it's going to look just like that. Do the same thing on the other side. Okay. Next one up, we're going to be doing the purple. So we're going to take our purple blocks. We're going to go one, two, three, four. Go to the other side, right? Four there. We're going to break all eight of these. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take our pillars and we're gonna put them down like that. Okay, so make sure you just face them down. Like you don't want them, you don't want them to face out like this. You want them to face out like that. So there's enough of a difference between the two. We're gonna put our crying obsidian just like that. And we're gonna put our purple slabs just like so. Now we're gonna take our trap doors and you're gonna put them on the second one up and the second one down. Okay, and then we're gonna take, as you can see, we're taking our crimson trap doors, which look really good against purple. And we're gonna put them just like that, okay? Do the same thing on the opposite side. Let's swing around to the side now. We're going to take our purple stairs. We're gonna go right there with it. Then we're gonna do regular purple blocks, two rows of them, and then upside down purple stairs like so. Now all we're gonna do is on this second one down, which is the uh, purple block, we're gonna put slabs there and then slabs there, like so. So right where the stairs are, it's kind of diagonal up, and then on the top where the stairs are, it's diagonal down. Okay, do the same thing on the other side. Okay, now for the top, we're gonna take our end stone brick wall, and we're gonna come here, right there and right there. We're gonna do the same thing on the top. Okay, underneath it, or on top of it, I should say, for this bottom one, we're gonna go regular stair, or, uh, regular stairs, the end stone brick stairs, and then upside down, same on this side. Regular and upside down. Coming across the top, we're gonna do some end stone. Then in the middle, okay, we're gonna have some honeycomb blocks. So you're gonna break two rows back, right? Because we had the, the dirt out to here. And then see how we have the stairs that kind of flares out? We're gonna just keep that going with the end stone brick slabs, just like that. 
Okay, then we're gonna take our acacia trap doors. I like to face the buckles going towards the top, so you put them on the bottom, on the bottom, and then for the top, you start it on the top and the buckles face down. Okay, do that all on, on the other side as well. Let's swing around to the side. We're gonna take all of this dirt and we're gonna put the uh, end stone bricks, just like so. On the very bottom of the brick, we're gonna come out two. So it's gonna be four, a two by two pattern of the end stone wall. Same thing on the top, just like so. We're gonna take our acacia wood slabs, just like that. And then we can go ahead and we can put buttons right on top of these far out ones. And we're actually gonna do the same thing on these right here. I forgot about those. So that was from the first set that we built. Okay, now go ahead and do this on that side. Now let's just go ahead and cover the top with the acacia wood slab. So we're gonna go all the way across, right up to the buttons, and then same thing here, right above where the trap doors are. Okay, now I'm gonna show you what it looks like attached to the other one. Okay, so there it is. There's the entire totem completed with the previous version as well. Let me know what you think in the comments. That's gonna do it for me. Until next time, Captain Obvious out. Peace.